Lego the Lego movie. Get away, Collider. Hi, this is Jacob Angelino, and this is my first, well, our first Lego review on the Lego movie set. It's Getaway Glider set number 70800, and 104 pieces, pages 6 through 12. And as you can see, you get a normal instruction manual. And you can see the box. And it has like that movie uh, film thing on it. So I like how they did that. It includes De um, Deputron. Sheriff not a robot, but he is a robot. And Emmett. And it comes with a cactus and a glider and a horse. And let's go to those right now. Oh, this is Deputron. Um, it's technically a cowboy robot. And it has, doesn't have like a pistol or any kind of guns like that. It has like a alien looking gun. And if you take off his hat, you can see his face better. He is a robot. And he has gray gloves, so I don't gray hands, so I don't know if that's a part of his robot or if it's a part of him being a cowboy wearing gloves. And I'll take out the gun and show you it later. But you could see his body and uh, pants have cowboy looking printing and now uh, let's go to the back of him he has no face printing on the back of him but he does have some printing on the back of his torso and it is um the back of his vest and now let's go to sheriff not a robot why am I keep on forgetting to take the minifigures off the horses? Like, I did that in my Hobbit one, Rookwood Elf Army with the Warg, but I forgot to do this with the horses. I'll show you the guns later and stuff, but this is Sheriff Not a Robot. I just pull the guns back here. He looks like a gangster, kind of, with his black vest and a sheriff combined. He is also a robot, but... He wants people to think that he's not a robot, so that's why his name is that. He has a star on his black cap. And let's see his face without the mustache. So this is the him without the thing. I just took off his cap so you can see his face better. He has eyes kind of like Deputron. See, he has like, but Deputron has like one eye, it's like, like a square. He has two eyes that are circles. You can see he has kind of a beard. And let's see his back. Also, the back of a vest. Let's go to Emmett. Okay, so this is Emmett. And he is the main character of the Lego movie. He is in most of the sets. Not not in some of them, but he is in most of them. So you can see he has a scared face. And you can see that he has a name tag on his foot. that says Emmett. It's really hard to see, but if you look really closely, it says Emmett. And he is wearing a vest also, like a jacket or a vest or something like that. And it also has a pen in there right over here. And let's see the back of him. So, and it has the brick of resistance on the back of him. And they glued it on with a special material. I don't, I forget what it's called, but I look up the plot and the glue is actually the thing that he's wearing it on. So let's see it without the brick of resistance. Here is him without the brick of resistance, and you can see that his neck piece is the glue. I see him without the neck piece. He has the back of his jacket or vest or something like that. Pretty sure it's a jacket, though. Um, I'd see him without his hair. So he has his gray face. On the other side, 
he has a scary face when he's riding the glider, but right now he has a brave face. And he's what he's a face that you try and Sheriff not a robot. Let's see the um the horse now. So this is the horse that Sheriff not a robot was riding, and this is the front view, side view, another side view, and back view, and this is the new horse. Well, not really that new, but it's still horse, like the newer, the newest version of the horse that was introduced in the Lord of the Rings and Hobbit sets from last year that can move its legs like this. The old horse is supposed to move its head and have like a kind of new shape with his leg like in different directions. So you could like make it like push the grass and try to kick Emmett. And here is the horse. Wait, I mean, like the horse has a piece, so for the what for what and I mean not Deputron, see if not a robot doesn't ride him, so let's see that. So this is the horse without the armor and it look with the end of the piece on, it looks kind of like a wild horse that's not really tamed yet. And the many people can't stand on it. Well you can't well I mean like you could stand on the armor but like in well you can't stand inside of it but he could stand actually on the horse. And they could also do sitting on it. I like, I like how Lego includes that piece with all the horses. It's it's like a good way. So let's go to the weapons. This is the alien looking gun or robotic looking gun that that Ishan was holding. And I like the look of it. It's really, really cool. Um this thing has like like I think I have like another set with it. Like it's supposed to hold like a dart or something like that or a shot. Um, this tiny thing, but it doesn't come with it, so I'm pretty sure they use that as like it a magnifying glass to aim. And let's go to the pistols. These are the pistols that Sheriff Daughter Robot was holding. And we do get these in a lot of sets, like in the Pirate and Old West one, so I know exactly why they use it in this set. And now let's go to the cactus. This is the cactus that is included in the set. I like it. It's a nice build. But they should have included, like, printing on it, like, to show, like, the spikes. Like, maybe, like, some dots to show the spikes. Or maybe, like, some lines to show the spikes. Because that would be, be like, a lot of detail. Because some plants actually look like this. Like, like this is, like, a stem and, like, some leaves. So, I like... But I do like the cactus. It's a good um, accessory in the set. And here is, well, I'm about to go to the glider. This is the glider. And I like how they did that. It's like, it looks like a messed up or broken bank. And it's just, I like how they did that. And then if you want to make like a bank, you can just take off these pieces and connect them to the bank that you're building so and it also has a keep out sign here that's kind of broken too they have this with the chain so it looks like M is holding on to it but there's actually this tiny stud over here which is a piece of resistance gonna hang on to so Emmett could stay on but it looks like the chain is keeping Emmett on like he's holding on to the chain over here so I like how they did that so it's easier to keep Emmett on. These wings do move, and these move back and forth too. This could, either I think, are the horns, but I like how they included the weather vane, which could spin 360 degrees around, and it falls off a lot, though. And then there are some flags that could move too. And it looks just like a glider. And there are some pole pieces and bent pieces over here, though. They show a lot of detail, and it has a lot of texture on it. So it's very ripe, a very rough piece um, Lego. So, um, so. Um, well. Let's put this video to an end. Okay, so I look up the ratings on LegoShop.com. So far, um, since this is the first day, 
Um, so far it has five ratings. Sorry, the box fell. But so far it has five ratings. Um, and it might change. You can say it's for today. But I hope you liked it. Um, and I am doing the review on the thing room. I had the set and I built it already. So I'm going to be making that one in a few minutes. Um, so I hope you look forward to seeing our Lego movie reviews. Remember to like, favorite, and subscribe. Bye!